free freedom from yeah. your addiction, Joni. Welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT Don. I might explode some more. Playing The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Yes, sir. We just beat uh, the Rock Rose Goma and freed the Gorons, Gor Gorons from their addiction. Hey, I can hardly believe you making me worry like that. I caught you. Please don't be mad at President Yanobo. It's it's okay, Sigiro. I'm the only one who made such a mess of things after all. I had just been more careful, you know, <laughs> shit wouldn't happen. You said you'd put Gorgon City back on the wait, back to normal, and you did it. <laughs> yes, back on the map too. I thought it was gonna say that too. <laughs> You're the hero of Gorgon City. You were uh you were when you made Yonobo Co and you still are now. I I thank you, Goro. And we've had to, uh, we have to thank you too, Link. You got, uh, you got a solder marble rock roast and, uh, and your smile is bringing the smile to my face. That ain't what he said. I keep imagining what might have happened if you, uh, I hadn't have broke that mask. Or if you didn't break it. Oh no, I can't even think about it even. He can't even think about he it. He can't. I don't want to think about it either. Princess Zelda was angry about the ruined mask, wasn't she? Or she wasn't, I don't know. Actually, we weren't able to catch up with her. Uh, it was so strange. Now that I think about it, it seemed like she was walking toward that giant monster by choice. After that, we didn't see her again. Aww. President Yanobo, do you think that maybe Princess Zelda uh, is one of the bad guys? Yes. What do you mean? Ah. Like maybe the giant monster was uh, pretending to be Princess Zelda? No way. Hang on. Come to think of it, the person uh, my ancestor referred to as a sage of time, she said the swordsman Link. Now, uh, now that I think about it, that was definitely Princess Zelda. Uh, yeah, dude, that's crazy. But whatever the case, that means that the princess we saw was an imposter even. I'll tell you guys uh, at Yanobo Co. to search the area around the city, and uh, if we find any leads, we'll let you know. Even if you're not here, we'll still be on the lookout. You can count on us. Yanobo uh, Sage of Fiery. He did it. The enthusiasm is great, but all that's not. We got some digging to do. Let's go get some rocks. Come on, President Yanobo. Tell me I didn't ad-libbed at the high heaven it was good <laughs> it was like hey link <laughs> you visited rito village zoro's domain and gerudo town you've gathered a lot of info by now why don't you go back and report it all to pura i'm sure she's sh what how do you even know you. how does he know about her though we never brought her up I mean, I get it. It's, you know, saying, hey, you got all the sages. Now you need to go back to Pura. I appreciate that. But how do you know? What do you mean by that? Like, what do you mean by the that? Game told them to do it. Nah, fam. What do you mean by that? I'm never talking to you guys ever. We're going to go to a couple shops real quick just to see if there's uh, anything interesting. Yep. I think we'll buy some more of this Gorgon spice. How much are they? 16? Uh, I bought... Oh, man. How much are... Wait, I can buy more than that, right? No, I'll just buy all three. I'll buy you out. Yeah, buy them, buy them out of them. <clears throat> oh, Jones, look. There's arrows over here. What? That's too... No, I'm never spending Five arrows for 20? I'm never spending that. Nope. I refuse to spend that my money on arrows. Wasn't there one more shop, I think, of import here? Yeah, it was all the armor. Uh... I thought there was a guy who, this guy, this guy as well, I wanted to see what you had. What do you want? Do you still want Topaz? Uh, now that the Marble Rock was on, the Gorons can go back to the usual grind. I finally uh, feel like I can relax and go, yeah, 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 cool, you can go ahead. So, you're back, so you want me to sell, right? Uh, topazes, I don't have that many. I don't have that, so I can't do that. But this guy might be actually willing to sell with me now that the shop's open. 
Welcome, 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 welcome. He looks like Bam Bam from the Flintstones. <laughs> he does. Or, or like uh, Gabrielle Cinebe. I don't even know who that is, but that's precious. Oh, <laughs> it's precious from the oh, from the Lord, movie yeah. Precious. Is there a problem with him looking like Gabriel Cinebe? I don't think there is. Is this what I have, or is this what he wants? This is just sell. Okay, this is just sell. So look, how many of all of these do I have, John? I only have eight of those, eight of those, seven of those. I have thirteen of those. You have thirty-one or something. Thirty-one amber. Let's see what happens if I sell. No, you don't have thirty. Oh yeah, okay. Thirty-seven actually. So let's sell and then seven. On the next row down, you have a, a lot of a few different other things too. Well, it says seventeen amber. That only gives me a hundred. That's like nothing. So those are kind of not even worth it to me. Yeah, but you have some more. The pink uh, salt. Yeah, I see the, it. I see. I see it. Luminous, uh, stone. luminous stone. What does it say? Some cereal. Twenty. You have thirty-one. Yeah, yeah but what's what's his, what's the description? Oh, this stone could be used as a base to make special clothing. Okay, I think I might want to hang yeah, on. Yeah, probably. That. Honestly, I feel like I might want to hang on to a lot what's of. What's the stuff. salt do? And the other one? That's for cooking. It's a cooking item. Uh, what's the, what's it, next it only to sells it? for two rupees. This only sells for oh, five. Flint. Flint. I mean, I could sell some flint. I guess it sells for five. How many do I have? 66. I definitely don't need that many. 56, yeah. Yeah, let's sell 26 of it. It didn't give me much, though. So it looks like the big money items are definitely still going to be like... Topaz. Yeah, the gems. So I need to kind of farm gems in order to get like big money. I don't even know if opal's super important. But I do know that going to like the fairies, you need gems to... uh upgrade armor sometimes so i don't want to sell all of everything either right. way i think we did we did we did good work jones we're gonna head back yeah right i don't really i don't see a point in staying here going to mama's house yeah i think Pura? so yeah i think so I hate <laughs> you hate everybody and everything you're not wrong so you know what it kind of uh, I don't kind hate of our audience. Kind of evens out there. I love them. Uh, do I see Jonas? You know what? Everybody's allowed to make bad decisions in life. Wow. And uh, he doesn't mean an excuse audience. Me? Oh, they got to give me this. I was wondering when this was going to happen. Hello. <laughs> Jesus, man, I don't like that. That thing is scary looking. I don't know what. I don't care. Big ass ghost just. Getting in the goddamn way. You can fast travel the Pearl, right? I can. Yes, you're right. I was just looking around because uh, I got interested. I got kind of distracted. I saw some stuff down here, and I was like, Take "Oh, a look I want to go get some GD ore." And I was like, "There might be." Oh, see, there's a topaz in there, baby. That makes me think I should break more rocks. But yeah, we're gonna leave. Yeah, we're leaving. Some, what the heck is this thing? It's a big old rock to break too. Ooh, luminous, luminous stone. stone. Make some GD clothes. <laughs> I will make some clothes. Look at this. Look at that. Oh, that's a bad boy. All right. Bond. Well, when's the last time we fought, Jonas? Maybe we should fight real quick. We, just I mean, we just we did just fight a ball. Okay, fine. We're out of here. We're leaving, Jonah. You're right. I will get distracted, and I will forever do the wrong things until I am told otherwise. We're going back to Skyview. Uh, to look out landing. Let's go. Da, 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 da. Hey, I'm going to stall you out a little bit before we talk to Pearl. I'm probably going to upgrade um, either my hard containers if I can. Or do I take stamina this time? Ooh, I don't know. What did I take last time? Do you remember? I think I took stamina because I needed to get the Master Sword. Oh, yeah, you did. You did. So I think I'll take another heart container. Do I have enough uh, beans? I have five uh, beans, baby. Oh, get bean. I got five little stink seeds in my pocket. Going to grow some vermilion. What color is vermilion, Jonas? What does it sound like to you? Green. Right? It sounds like it's a green, but it's actually red. It's crazy how that works. It's like a deep red. Uh, it is a deep red. Yeah, but it sounds green. I know. I I too made that mistake, and then I looked it up just the other night. And then there's also a flower of the the, the vermilionaire, which is absolutely hilarious for a flower name. 
because when you think of alienaire, you think of like you know a millionaire, and then you think of a million, you think of the color, and then you're like, oh, I get it. Oh, it's made of mercury sulfide. It's got a bunch of red in it. All right, baby. I think we're ready. To think that I could have had that extra heart for the for the Go Gamma fight too, but I didn't because I'm you like stubborn. To make things harder for yourself. I do, I do. I enjoy I enjoy making I'm things challenging. You didn't take your heart away. Did you notice that there was a bird flying up in the sky? It's Tulin's mom. It it, it really it, like you're joking, but <laughs> those are those are Rito Village. Yeah, you've done enough now. <gasps> oh. Jonas, there's Zoras here too! Yeah, they're all happy now. And there's a freaking oh my god, dude, it's everybody I've ever met! It's all the people of the yeah, villages! They're about to tell you that you gotta go fight the Ganon. Oh my god, I just realized! Do I I don't know if I know you, but sure. Oh, it's a lady from the lady village! Oh, that's nice. This they're is so here. cool, dude. They're all here at Lookout Landing now. Yeah, you freed the world from their... I, I guess I did. Just give it a chance. I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to Pura. I only have one. I only have eyes for one. Only and one love. Oh, look. It's all the freaking the guys now. It's all the guys. <laughs> Pura, where are you? Wasn't that Pura down there? Where? The, the green guy? Pura is oh, the little girl. Uh, she's a, she, not the little girl, but the like the older lady. I think she's in here. I'm, I'm, just, I'm I'll admit that I'm just kind of like looking around a little bit. I thought she would have been closer. Oh, what's that? I don't know. Did we already interact with this thing? Yeah, I don't know. I can't do anything with it. I don't know. Ooh, let's get up there. It's probably something for sex. Pura's a freak. I'm telling you. I can tell. Yeah, it's her dungeon door. Probably. Oh, look. I was right to come up here. Yep. What up, girl? Linky! <laughs> I heard what happened. You're supposed to do this voice. The major cold front yep. that descended upon the Rito and the marbled rock roast that the Gorgons could get enough of, couldn't get enough of. Uh, then there was a sludge contaminating the Zora water, and finally the Gerudo menaced by Gibdos and the Sand Shroud. You faced some serious challenges, and you overcame all of them. Well done, Link. We did it. So the person resembling Princess Zelda was behind the scenes of all of the phenomena as you discovered. This has this has to be related to the upheaval somehow, and I have something important to share as well. Hmm. I have Zelda in a cage. And I think on the next episode, don't look at that screen. <laughs> <laughs> don't look at it if I can go here. On the next episode, Johnny. All right, that's all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe for Jonas. TNT. Oh, uh, yeah.